welcome back to 504 Road Trips. Today we'll be starting a short series of a drive from Greensburg, Louisiana to the suburbs of New Orleans on the West Bank in the city of Gretna. We'll be following several highways over the next four videos. This drive took place on December 5, 2022, and although we've covered most of this route in previous videos, most notably I-55 and I-10, this will serve as an update to those interstates. Today we begin in Greensburg, traveling east on Louisiana State Highway 10. LA-10 crosses the state of Louisiana, covering nearly the entire state from the Mississippi state line to its western terminus, just 15 miles short of reaching Texas. We've seen small stretches of this highway on the John James Audubon Bridge and in the town of Franklinton, and we have plans to cover the entire length of it in a future series. LA-10 is notable for duplicating the number of I-10, which crosses southern Louisiana, and the two routes run parallel to each other, although it seems the Louisiana Department of Transportation deemed that the separation between the two highways was enough that there wouldn't be any confusion. From its eastern terminus to Morganza, Louisiana, LA-10 follows the Zachary Taylor Parkway, a Louisiana scenic byway. We enter Tangipahoe Parish here, organized in 1869 during the Reconstruction Era. As noted by a sign at every entrance to the parish, Tangipahoe is home to the current Louisiana Governor, John Bell Edwards. At a diamond interchange, we exit right to Interstate 55 South, which we covered northbound in its entirety in 2021. 
I-55 runs 964 miles between Laplace, Louisiana and Chicago, Illinois via Memphis, Tennessee and St. Louis, Missouri. We're 53 miles from I-55's southern terminus and driving through the pine forests of northern Tangipahoe Parish. At exit 50, a tight diamond interchange connects I-55 with LA-1048, providing access to the towns of Arcola and Roseland, both of which are to the east on US Highway 51. US 51 parallels or runs concurrent with I-55 through the remainder of I-55. Exit 46 connects I-55 with LA-16 seen in a previous series, with the city of Amy just to our left and Montpelier a few miles to the right. At exit 40, Louisiana Highway 40 crosses with the town of Independence to our east. 
This is one of several examples where the highway number and exit number are coincidentally the same, and this is where we'll conclude part one of this trip. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up, post a comment, subscribe, share and follow us on social media, and join us for our next 504 road trip.